The short video, Damsels in Distress by Sharptail Media, crashed the fly fishing internet, so we're pretty sure that you've seen it by now. Coming across rarities like Big Browns leaping out of the water on a spring creek is extremely exciting. It certainly doesn't happen every day. The good news is that you won't have to figure out how on earth to hover a fly over a spring creek to catch a trout. It'll likely sip or slam any pattern drifting over when it's like this. Oh, you see that? He totally broke on that one. Absolutely totally broke on it, but it swerved. He wants every dragonfly going through there. We've run into a few moments where it sure would have been nice to have an adult damsel or dragonfly pattern in any of our 15 boxes we usually carry. It kind of slips your mind if you don't live in an area of the world where this happens often. So the chances are that you won't have a fly pattern to match the hatch. Now what? What do you do when you don't have a pattern to match the present food source, but have a ton of other flies in your boxes? It's like he's waiting in ambush in that pillow, hey? Yeah. There is always on-stream adjustments yeah. that you have to make in fly fishing. If you're the kind of person that thinks along the lines of A plus B equals C, you might be in trouble. Definitely damsel takes, eh? Okay. It absolutely sucks when a magical event is happening and you don't have the right fly. But with a little imagination, you might be able to adjust something in your fly box and at least hope for the best. It worked. Nice. Right on. It worked. <laughs> Funny, eh? He was just smashing the damsels. And had just smashed one before I did that. What do you know? <laughs> awesome. awesome, man. So, all I had in my box was this kind of stimulator, kind of oversized caddis or a sedge and it was taking red damsels and I said well let's just grab the biggest one of those I have and I just took the hair wing right down the middle and I just started to massage it and just back combed it back combed it back combed it and in order to get that to look like a damsel I essentially just forced it wide splayed the wings and that's as good as I could do it. And that, in a way, looks like a splayed wing damsel. Good enough. Yeah, so, there you go. I just, they're not splayed right now, but I definitely splayed the wings on that sedge. Yay. Yeah. Cool. Awesome, like a shot, eh? Like a shot. Yeah, got lucky. <laughs>